Hey guys, Crewman here, and in this video, I am going to teach you how to build a cheap server case. Basically, the idea is to take an open air mining frame rig, an open air mining rig, and convert it into this server case. Now, I've tried it multiple ways. I've spent a lot of time test fitting, and this is not even the first time I've recorded it, but basically, a regular size motherboard does not fit. You got to get rid of it, it just it won't work. Unfortunately, I tried. So basically, it comes down to you need something like a mining specific motherboard, basically something this big. This is one of those um, BC, B250Cs. I just actually broke it out of a rig. Um, it actually fits quite perfectly in this. And it, it it's funny because it barely lines up with all the, um, barely lines up with all the holes. Um, I've been like looking for ways to, to make it work. And you can only get like two of the holes lined up, but that should be all that you need to um, to get this working, if we're being honest. And I gotta find my screwdriver. So essentially, the goal is to get, you'll be able to get six in here. And we're gonna use a 1000 watt power supply because as you might have seen in my last video building out of this server case, you really only have one room for one power supply. And um, you know, when powering eight, 3070s, I used a 1600 watt, which might have been a tiny bit overkill, but I wanted to be safe. And with this one, I'm going to be use, putting six 5600 XTs and well, five 5600 XTs and one 5700. And I know that they basically only take 100 watts at the wall, so you're looking at about 500 watts plus. So that's for five of them and then 150 for the 5700 XT. So you're at a total of um, like 750 watts, 800 watts. So 750 watts, 800 watts for the, uh, maybe 825 on the watts for the um, this thing, for this motherboard. It probably uses basically no power. Um, so that is why I am honestly not worried. A uh, thousand watt will be more than fine with this. Running the numbers again, right? So you're looking at 500 watts, 650 for all the graphics cards, maybe seven. So you, and then probably about 150 watts between all of the fans, the motherboard. Uh, so I don't, I don't, I think this will be more than enough. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and get these fans wired in quickly. Uh, I'm actually just, now you're just going to see this as I go fast. I just wanted to kind of quickly go over what we needed to do. And I'm just going to quickly show you how I build in this. And then when it's done, I will give you some guidance. So I'm going to go build it right now. <laughs> Something hit me last night Yeah, I was on my usual drive And suddenly I realized I've been driving down the same streets all my life Looking out the window as a child But now I'm in the driver's seat An old friend sent me to speak And the only thing I know to say Is that the days change but the roads stay the same And all you really have is one shot To find your voice, make a name Use your pain, ignite a flame Take hold of your life and fight for change Don't you dare let your light go to waste Cause it really is true what they say In a second it could all fade away Music is what you make it When it's real you can't fake it Breathing deep let your soul feel the right path Then you just take it Imagine finally free Be what you're meant to be An opportunity takes your hand Says you're coming with me Oh, how lucky I am To know both the mountains and the city streets Been up and down 95 A couple too many times These roads know they never sleep and the only thing I know to say is that the days change, but the roads stay the same. And all you really have is one shot to find your voice, make a name, use your pain, not a flame. Take a hold of your life and fight for change. Don't you dare let your light go to waste. Cause it really is true what they say. In a second, it could all fade away. Just on my usual track. Yeah, the 
that's all I know It's how I've learned to survive How lucky I am to know both the mountains and the city streets Been up and down 95 a couple too many times These roads know they never sleep And the only thing I know to say is that the days change but the roads stay the same And all you really have is one shot to find your voice, make a name Use your pain, ignite a flame, take a hold of your life and fight for change So just tell it you like, go to waste Cause it really is true what they say And the second it could all fade away so say what you want And say what you need Oh, you make all the noise, baby, baby But then you don't speak All right, guys, uh, the fast forward's done. It's basically finished. Uh, there's not much to say about it. I So you guys saw I ended up splitting it. I couldn't get the Molex cables down here. They would clip the fans. I didn't want to ruin them. These things only take 150 watts as well. The one takes 148 watts at the wall. The rest of these take 100. So I really didn't feel bad about putting splitting the riser. Um, I think it's all very safe. It's on a thousand watt power supply. Uh, like I said, it's 500, 650. These are like 65 watts each. So like seven, 750, maybe 800 with this with this mini mother mining motherboard, 850 max. But I highly doubt it's even that much for being 100% honest. And I am definitely not putting this server case on its side. I just, um, I just don't feel comfortable doing it. Uh, it. I mean, it's stable, but I probably am just gonna leave it on its, or I'm sorry, like vertically. I'm probably just gonna leave it on its side. Um, as far as would I do this again, the answer probably is no. I mean, this is, this is definitely an exercise in a big pain in the rear. Like, this is cool that I was able to do it. Like, it was $100 for, or $106 for this case, or maybe it was $126, I don't know. Either way, it wasn't much, and I had everything. Like, I had the BC260, I had the power supply, which is the point of this, right? Oh, you have to screw these in from the other, the other side. That's not gonna work. Um, yeah, well, I have to go over here. Anyway, uh, the point of this was to build a cheap server case. So, I mean, in that sense, I succeeded. You know, even the graphics cards were, you'd be furious at me if I told you the price of these things. But that's not the point. The point is, I don't think this is worth the hassle. I mean, it was cool that I could do it. 
Definitely not going to do it again. I don't think I'd recommend it. You need like, you need low power. Well, so you could do this with, so theoretically, right? You could do this with like a 3070 rig or a 3080 rig, but they have to be two slot cards, first of all. Second of all, they have to be two, yeah, two slot cards max. Second of all, you have to have a really, really big power supply to do this. Because uh, you could, you know, you need 1600 watts probably. Because you definitely will need to split the risers. Um, just like the other issue I had building that other eBay server case. Would I do it again? I don't know. Uh, I kind of don't like some of the power dynamics of it. But that server case is more than safe. And as will this one be. Uh, I don't foresee any issues. It's stable. So we're going to put the top on. And we are going to power... Or, yeah, we're going to power it because I have plenty of power here. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm not even touching what this can do max. I mean, I've got six GPUs and four eights and yeah. We're definitely going to crank this on. So we're going to turn this on because I want to control the fan settings. Um, and I kind of just want to see if it posts and everything works. So... Uh, let me be right back. All right, I just want to show you guys it works. Uh, I tested it off camera, troubleshoot it for a second. I had a bad SATA cable. Uh, it's the second one on these EVGA GQs. It's kind of scary. Um, but anyway, check it out. Everything posts. Uh, the fans are good. I just got to seal it up. The reset button works. And it is cool because the BC250 perfectly lines up with the server uh, with the, um, the hole for the server motherboard. Audio cut out for the last bit of this video. I don't know why, but anyway, guys, I just wanted to reiterate that I don't think this is worth it, even though it was cool. If, however, you really, really need to save money, I'll put a link down for this case down below. You can fit six two slot GPUs in this mining, mo in this server case, along with, um, that mining motherboard that I stated, the BC uh, 250 i'll link it from an ebay or an amazon seller if i can find it um yeah like i said it's great in the sense that you get to reuse all the parts you have and for 100 bucks 120 bucks you can basically turn your open air frame into a server case so thank you again for watching uh please like and subscribe crew man out